Hey guys and welcome back to the channel and today I just had my baby shower so I'm going to be showing you guys what I got as my baby shower gifts. So let's start with these two bags which seem to be stuck together. So we have a cute little monkey. <laughs> you like the monkey? It's for your brother, for Ezra. You can hold it, look after it. A little um, comforter with a little bear on it and it's ridiculously soft, I love it. And it says, hello little one on it, I don't know if you can see. Bye. Abba. And then this gorgeous little outfit and it comes with a hat, hang on, and there's little, little pandas on your feet. Can you see them? How cute is it? A little panda hat. And if you don't know, I love pandas like so, so much. And I was actually going to get this like next time I had a bit of um, money to, to spare but no I don't have to and it's in three to six which is good because it's um, quite nice and thick and uh, soft so it'll be good for when winter comes um, yeah and this cute little hat which will also be awesome for when winter comes this is up to three months so it'll be good for like autumn as well and all the autumny pictures I'm probably going to take of Ezra. So it's gorgeous. And sticking on the panda front. I'll look at the hats first. This is a little yellow and grey star hat. And then also a panda hat. How cute. And the little pandas. I love it. There's so much panda. And this is in newborn size, so he can work straight away, as long as he doesn't have to on his head. Ooh, you okay? But last time he got his head, like, they measured it on the ultrasound, it was like a week behind or something. So hopefully he'll have a decent, oh, decent sized head, like a small-ish head. But yeah, and this, which is also newborn, and it's a three-piece set. Mine. And it's got a little bib that says, Happy Little Me. Then you've got the I Love Cuddles and a panda. And then a, a little sleep suit with the grey and yellow stars on again. And I actually have this already in three to six months. And I was thinking I wanted it for the hospital bag. Um, like possibly a going home outfit, even though I have two already. Um, and yeah so I ended up not having to buy it because um, my friend Shan's got it for me in newborn size so I now have it in this size and in three to six months so when he grows out of this I'll still have to get to put it on and again and this also has little panda feet too so I'm gonna try and try and keep them in their respective bags so we get that one <laughs> I know who to thank for things. Oh, mama. But yeah, so far Ezra's well and truly spoiled already and he's not even here yet. Uh, here we go. From, <laughs> still some of the straw stuff. Uh, this came in a bag with like all this straw stuff in it. Which was so cute. But very, very hard to get off everything. I do. So again, this I do. up to three months. And it's just this gorgeous old snowsuit. So soon as the weather gets cold I'm enough for snowsuits, I will have something suitable for him. It looks bigger than I expected for uh, up to three months. But I suppose you know, it's got lots of great room. <laughs> I don't know if you can hear that. But uh, Sander really wants to cuddle it. There you go, give it a cuddle. Oh, it is seriously so, so soft. And um, got this little hood and uh, the bears on the bottom and then the paw print on the bottom of that. And they also 
gave me this is from Ellie's best friend from uh, preschool and I'm now friends with his mum so it gave me that the snowsuit and this really really cute hooded blanket and it's not too thick either which I think quite a lot of my blankets at the moment are really th thick so I'm it's nice to know that I've got a not so thick one as well. And then staying on blankets, I will show you this one first because it's adorable. It's an owl. It's an owl blanket. A dog. Yeah, streaking it, are you? What does it say? Baby owl blanket. Let me just see if I can unravel it and hope I can re ravel it again afterwards. Uh, there's a little. Here we go. Find a step away a bit. Here we go. A little velcro sticky bit here so we can wrap it back up again. But yeah. It's adorable. And so, so soft. It's all so soft. I could just. Hello. I could just wrap up in this myself, to be honest. But yeah. It's super cute. Wow. Wow. Mm. All right. Let's wrap this back up again. Let's see how easy it is to wrap up as well. Make sure we're wrapping the right bit. Mm. No, that's the wrong bit. Don't touch that. I did it. No. I did no, it. don't touch Mummy's camera when I'm recording. No, 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 no. no. I am, Mama. I am. You stop now. There we go. And I've lost a little bit. I've lost the thing. So yeah, that's pretty easy to roll back up as well. As long as I don't do this little tab thing. How cute is that? That was, I think that was from my mum. And this one too, which has got these gorgeous little clouds on it. And oh my god. Seriously, I think this is the softest of the lot. I, I, I could fall asleep right here. And it's nice and uh, spotty on the back. So yeah. Loads and loads of really soft, gorgeous blankets. Seriously? A butt up. up. Oh, are you looking at unrolling it? Cheeky chops. Yeah. Yeah, he says. And then some other stuff from my mum, which is more for me, um, is a, a 2017 like diary with... Baba? Oh, Baba? Did you unroll the owl? Alright, sort that out in a minute. Um, it's got contacts in it and dates, all that kind of stuff. And it's super pretty oh, and shiny writing. <laughs> Um, Mommy. and some Ding. bath salts. I don't know if they have any like specific scent or anything, but yeah. Come here, come here. Sit next to me. Okay. Yeah, bath salts. Let's see them. And a manicure oh, set. So that will go straight into my hospital bag when I get out of the packaging. And it's got the nail clippers, this little, whoop, little scissors, a nail file, some tweezers, and one of those things you use to get the dirt out from underneath your nails. I don't know what they're called. So yeah, I had a really great time at the baby shower, and I love literally all of these gifts. And all oh, the blankets are so soft, I could just literally fall asleep under them. <laughs> or like cuddled up to them. Xander has done a, a number on this one, so I'm going to re-wrap it up now. Um... Thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed this little video. And if you did, give it a thumbs up. If you're feeling friendly, leave a little comment down below. Tell me what your favourite gift out of this lot was. Uh, my nan did give me a gift. She gave me a little nighty um, with a, not quite a dressing gown, but kind of like a, a shawl or something to go over the top of it. And a little bit of money as well. Um, so that's, uh, we've now got 
our emergency money for getting to the hospital mm -hmm. and for out the hospital. And hospital bags are packed. Mm -hmm. There will be a video. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Thank you. Mm -hmm. A video on that soon. And Thank you. Baby could come any day now. I have got two weeks left to the day today until my due date. So he could come any time between sort of now and I suppose three weeks. But they said they don't want me to go past a week over because of our previous C-section. Um, and it increases risks of the scar tearing or something or rupturing. I can't remember. If you want to hear more about that, leave comments asking and then I will get all the information together and make a video about a, a VBAC, which is basically a normal birth after a cesarean section. So yeah, that's the end of the video here. Thanks again for watching and I will see you in the next one. Bye!